Hi guys, welcome to Code Artisan Lab. This is video number 17 for multi vendor e commerce website in Django with React.js. In this video, we are going to uh, continue our work in our home page design. Uh, we have uh, two things that is pending in our home page design one is customer rating and review, and another one is footer. Right? In our previous video, we have created the API for the our product category list. Okay? So, uh, I'll just say you please check out the playlist you will understand everything okay so <clears throat> and if you are new to this channel then please subscribe this channel like this video share this video and uh, support me okay all right so <clears throat> now in this video let's uh, continue our work so the thing is we need to create customer rating and review right so for the customer rating and review i have an idea that uh, from because we are using the bootstrap so in the bootstrap bootstrap providing a boo, uh, let's say a block code so block code is here okay and it is saying uh, like if someone is saying anything then we can show the name or the email anything right and this is the alignment and uh, we can show center left or right whatever uh, we need whatever we, we like okay i will show in the center right and with the help of uh, this block code okay we will show the you know reviews right and we will show rating also because uh, and we will show the rating in the you know font or some icons uh, like we have added in our previous to previous video and we will show this block code in a carousel right so uh, maybe carousel I don't know what the spelling let's say bootstrap carousel right so here we have bootstrap carousel okay so this is uh, fourth okay so let's copy this paste here example okay so this is the carousel it will slide okay so from left to right or right to left whatever you want okay so this is the slider we can show like this navigation also okay so let's create this with the combination of carousel and uh, combination of carousel and this block code okay so let's go here and after this popular series end we will say uh, rate uh, rating and reviews okay so this will end so you can listen the dog barking okay no worries is sorry to me i don't have any control over that all right so uh this is our second slide okay so let's uh, div class row and uh, actually we don't need this we can just simply copy paste this copy paste here and let's see the indentation all right and then we will change the class name because it should be camel case all right okay actually dog is barking because some kids are passing over there and uh, he's just barking from you know from the gate okay so uh, what is that what is this oh I understand we need to close the tags the image tags okay actually we don't would we, we will not keep the image we will add the uh, name so this is next previous why this is showing like this oh did you see that we named it wrong all right okay so this is fine hmm so where is the here you can see that this is showing okay so let's say uh, we will show this oh where is that actually this should be collapse okay uh, carousel let's add margin top four you can see and uh, let's add okay let's add one more thing here this is in the container right 
uh, yes this is the container let's add one more thing border let's see all right so this is showing here and let's margin vertical so top bottom four so this is all right now <coughs> what is that okay all right so as of image we will add the block code right so let's say block code and we will add the center center one right so this is well some famous footer and this is one we will copy this one right and we'll say it here okay and this will be not a sibling so we will go in there and the class name should be class name paste here and then paste here okay so this is figure one let's copy this all right paste here all right and then paste here okay so when we go here then he can see that this is one two three right we can do one thing uh, this is carousel inner and we have given let's say bg dark text white okay so this is something like that okay one more thing let's say padding five so this is some padding all right so now this is our rating and review now we are showing the review we are showing the name name of any person you know so source title uh, some famous in source title so here we will show the rating and in this source title we will show the name okay so we will show the customer name okay and here we will show the rating so how we will show the rating we will show the rating as a star so class name f a f a star definitely we will check that that uh, how it is uh, showing so here we will show in the figure of cap actually we will change the figure caption here okay in the three of them so customer name and this is star so this is star so we will say okay let's go to font awesome font awesome icons okay so font awesome all right then we will say star enter and uh, we need to go for free okay so star and we can also add star half so let's say full okay so star and let's add color text warning so warning means it will be show yellow hmm? so is this showing or not yep this is showing. okay so one two three three star and this is a uh, four star and uh, this is uh, yeah this is fine four star three star four star and four star four three three yeah this is fine this is nice okay so customer name and uh, star and the description okay so we will make some limit for the review like uh, 50 character or 100 character right so it will make our system more uh, you know more semantic okay now we have created from the document list from the feature list we have created the customer rating and review now we need to create the footer so we will create the footer okay so let's go for example so they are providing lots of example here let's open this open some examples footers here we have a footers so this one footer this footer and this footer and this footer also right so what kind of footer we need let's add this footer okay we will not add uh, if we need then we will add uh, another one but let's add this one foot okay so edit as html we will copy this and uh, in the app 
we have this uh, after let's add in the container footer start and here we have a footer end and if we go here in the all right so actually what we are doing here anything is wrong uh use okay so actually this is showing the image let's add here bootstrap oh no this is uh, let's say python python scripts okay uh, what else we have actually this is showing svg icons for the link no so what we will do we will do font awesome icons okay so remove this we have anchor and uh, we need to add a i tag class fa fa facebook all right so this is fine if you go here then you can see the facebook okay where is the facebook let's go facebook when we click here <coughs> okay so mm, let's add uh, let's add this one okay so brands it should be brands okay so facebook brands so it is showing the oh sorry where it is showing the face okay this is showing the facebook now let's add here fa 2x so it will increase the size now so copy this paste paste let's say instagram now popular website let's say twitter okay so instagram twitter and everything is linked okay uh what we else have python uh padding this is showing padding let's say two because uh, yeah this line is uh one moment let's remove this line okay and uh, why this is showing why this is uh, just touching the line let's add some padding top three uh, two all right this is fine okay so now this is our footer let's add margin five okay some space for the footer okay so this is our footer okay we will if you are uh, you know if this is not according to our requirement then we can change okay maybe later we will add this footer okay but let's add this and uh, later we will design that okay but uh, for the structure this is fine okay so python scripts and uh, footer is added uh, and this one is also added what else we need to do so we can create we can start the next pages right so from the next video we will start our next page all category list all product list okay and if i forgot something then please uh, add in the comment section so that i can add that okay so i hope you are enjoying this series and uh, please uh, like this uh, channel follow this series and uh, share this series okay share this playlist and uh, thank you so much and for the bootstrap uh, i'll just suggest you that please explore the documentation also and uh, explore the icons that what icons if you want to change the icons then you can change and uh, you can explore okay so thank you so much for watching the video please support and please subscribe okay and uh, let's meet in the next video thank you